I'm speechless. Holy goddamn shit, Nathan! <laughs> That's your idea of speechless? God, how long do you think it took them to build this place? Hey, Sam, check it out. It's like a pirate code of conduct. Mm. I thought the whole point of this place was not having rules. Well, even pirate ships had their own rules. Hey, it looks like there's a path or something through there. Locked, of course. <clears throat> huh, horse bones. They're still tied up, like, like they were abandoned. But why? Don't know. Maybe people left in a hurry. Or they were taken away. Eh, something isn't kosher here. So what do you think happened here, huh? Captain Avery. Wondering when you'd turn up. <clears throat> this way, follow me. Hey, Sam, come here. This looks promising. Bye bye. You. Oh. Okay, guess we're not going back that way. It's like a hideout of some kind. Yeah, but who'd they be hiding out from? Themselves? Look at this. It looks like the layout of the commercial district. Uh, and... Boom, there's our treasury right there. See? There's the tower. What were these guys up to? That's our way out of here. I see some light down below.
That's all of them. Grab any ammo you can. That won't be the last of them. You think they're looking for us or the treasure? <laughs> no and Rafe? Both. Crap, my shoreliners. <sighs> Looks like rich boy with yeah, get over here. here they come. See any more? Or are we clear? I think we're clear. You all right? Yeah. Just a little winded. Come on, Sam! Steady as anything else around here. Oh, okay, so no. All right, all right. Here I go. Nathan, you got some more friends in your Aina. Eesh, this whole place is falling apart. Pass up, man. It's an old building over the edge. Hey, have you ever done anything like this? We've thrown a couple of buffaloes into villages. But this, this is something else. around the river. They'll be here soon. Okay, gents, stay sharp. Let's keep this jaw nice and tidy for the boss lady. Oh, 
our little brother. Well, shit. That's it. For now. <laughs> better keep moving. Ready? Ready. All right. Thanks. Careful. It's a long way down. Yeah, I see it. Okay. Oh, crap! What's that first step? It's a doozy. Yeah. <clears throat> Ladder's busted in the middle. We'll make do. Keep heading up. <clears throat> How you doing back there? It's a hell of a view. Almost there, Sam. Okay. Now what? Trust me and follow my lead, okay? Something like that. We're definitely in the high rent district now. Not residential, though. I think some kind of administration building? Probably. Maybe Libertalia had a zoning committee. <laughs> Maybe they paid taxes. Who knows? Nothing up here. Cannons, improvised barricades. What the hell happened here? Some kind of battle. It's a rhetorical question. The real question is who's fighting who? Why? Man, this is impressive. Uh, to say the least.
Here we go. Or not. You wanna give me a hand? Yeah. It's empty. Of course it is. You think Rafe? No. Nothing's been touched in here for hundreds of years. Right. Well, search for clues? Yeah, search for clues. Nada. Thief? Old manifest. Lots of treasure. Captain Avery. You've certainly seen better days. Huh, fancy clothes. What kind of uniform? Uh, you were a guard here, weren't you? Nice job. What the hell happened here? Good question. What if maybe there's no treasure left? You know, they spend it all on marble floors. So the colonists find out their money's gone and they get pissed. Yeah, maybe so. Another thief. What happened hey, here? Over here. Hey Nathan, check it out. What you got? The battalion money. It says Avery Sigil on it. Mm -hmm. Must have melted down with gold. Minted his own currency. So based on that, all the manifests on the shelves. The treasure was here. Yeah. Here's the bigger question. Where is it now? Okay. So we know that there was fighting outside. Dan, inside. What do you think the colonists stole it? No. I think they were trying to reclaim what was theirs. Look. Is Avery? Two? Founders of Libertalia. All marked with the word thief. Not murderer, not tyrant. Thief. So by the time the colonists busted in here, the treasure was already gone. Yeah, because these guys had already taken it for themselves. Pirates will be pirates, right? Uh, pirates will be pirates. Huh. I know where they moved it. Where? Oh, it's a map. Yeah, right there. That's our treasury. It's, it's a map of Libertalia. Right, so follow it to the other side of the island. Look, right there. New Devon. Avery was from Devon, England. 
He sure was. Man, those are some seriously large mansions. Each of them has its own sigil, too. Because that's where they lived. <laughs> you say we uh, climb that watchtower, huh? Get our bearings. New Devon, here we come. Now, how do we get up there? I got an idea. You give me a hand with this? Okay. Okay, ready? Okay, that's step one. Step two. Raise the chandelier. Good idea. <laughs> Sound surprised. Just take the compliment. <laughs> The place is looking classy. Let's get up there. Oh, nice one, Tarzan. Excuse me. Sorry, Condon. Baldridge. What? You're stepping on Baldridge. Oh, so I am. <laughs> All right. Up we go. I'm really shocked the stairs are intact. Hey, hey, hey. Don't jinx us. Oops. Spoke too soon. Like I said. You seeing this tower? Sure am. You Sam? Yeah. All right, just making sure you haven't plummeted to your death. <laughs> just about there. <laughs> sure is excited. Come on, ready? Ready. All right, I found something. Okay, stand back. Here you go. Come on. Crow's nest, huh? There it is. Just on the other side of the river. Now, how do you say we go? Rob from the rich, huh? <laughs> hey, is there a path down there? Uh, of sorts. Come on. So, how long do you figure it'll take us to get to New Devon? Well, a couple hours. Depends on what or who we bump into along the way. Where are you? I'm down here! 
Let's try this again. you on about? Oh, it's my safe word. Mm. Are you always this clever? Uh, have my moments. Yes. You and your brother have proven yourselves the more capable treasure hunters on the island. Shame we're not on the same side. Hey, there's, there's still time. Trust a trick. Mm. I'm not falling for that again. Hey, hey, just, just let's talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that was a bit rougher than expected. I just uh, see myself out. After everything, you think I'm just going to let you walk away? That'd be the wise thing to do. Come on, Nadine, really? We know you're a badass and all, but there's two of us. I don't think my men are on their way here right now. All I have to do is buy some time. That's if I don't finish it myself. God damn it. Go! <laughs> <laughs> Tired of this island! Tired of your brother! And I'm tired of you! I know you don't! Get caught! 
Guns down! All of you! No. Rafe, this guy's on edge. Oh, don't worry about him, Nadine. These guys don't kill anyone in cold blood. It's just not their style. You wanted to bet her life on that? Go ahead, then. Shoot her. Sam. I die, you both die. So be it. Not another step! You mean... like this? Sam, put the gun down. I warned you. Do it! Rafe! <laughs> Hold your fire! Don't shoot! Put it down. It's done. Okay? It's done. Don't worry, Nadine. It's not their style. I say, I didn't think he had it in him. <laughs> Samuel. You okay? I guess you knew this moment was coming, huh? Hey! Come on, man. You already got us. Take it easy. Come on, now you're business, man. Let's just... Let's work out a deal. Oh, a deal? Oh, yeah. I'll be here what you have in mind. <coughs> well, you can go ahead. I'm listening. I just... I... You want to find Avery's treasure? We'll help you find it. And in exchange, I let you live? Yeah. That and a small cut. <laughs> the gauchos on this guy. Just enough to get him his freedom, okay? His freedom? Nathan. Yeah. Did hard time. Our time. And the guy who broke him out, Hector Alcazar, he owes him a lot of money. Whoa. What the hell are you talking about, Nate? Hector Alcazar died in a shootout in Argentina like six months ago. I'm the one that got Samuel out. Oh. Wow. What did he tell you? Sam, what kind of story did you cook up? Alcazar? Really? You lied. You lied to your baby brother. We're wasting time. Just a second. Thing is, Nate, I never stopped looking. For Avery's treasure. I just keep running into these dead ends. <laughs> and then I hear that our dear old Samuel Drake, an authority on Avery, is alive and somewhat well. There was no breakout. I bribed the prison warden. And your brother, he just waltzed right out the front gate. He spent the last two years tracking down a second St. Dismas Cross. You know what? He did it all with me. Oh, okay. no, that's bullshit. Oh. Sam, care to refute? Nate. Oh, Sam. Jesus, no. No. Listen, Avery's treasure was ours. It was always ours. I left my light for you. <laughs> hey, look, look. Nate, if it's any consolation, he duped me too. He pulled a Houdini on me, he brought you. And that old man back into the mix, and I cannot lie, Sam, that really pissed me off. But, you know, all behind us now. You don't deserve it. You do? 
Last I checked, we're all a bunch of thieves, digging around where we shouldn't. Wraith? What? One way or another, end it. Or I will. Well, you heard the lady. Hey, you missed one clue, and you can kiss that treasure goodbye. You said it yourself, keep running into dead ends. Why don't you face it, Rafe? You need us. No, you're right. You're half right. I just need Sam. Wait, now you're making a mistake. Don't, you don't, don't, don't here anyway. Oh, no idea. But this is definitely the address. Been scoping the place out for the past few days. No one's home. <sighs> and here we are. Whoa. This place is humongous. <laughs> Where do we even start? I don't know. We start by finding a way in. And then we can take the grand tour. You think this place has an alarm? Let's try and find a way in that doesn't involve breaking the window. All right. Let's look around back, huh? Okay, give me your hand. All right, there you go. I can't jump that high. Here, follow me. Come on, Nathan. Whoa. Spooky. Oh, here. I brought a spare. So, are we looking for any particular room? Uh, just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? Here. Nope. It's not gonna be in this attic. Boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. Down we go. So, how do we find them? What, Mom's notebooks? I mean, don't you remember? She always used that off-white leather binding. We go. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? No. It's not one of mom's. You got the right idea, though. Let's keep looking. Hey, 
Hey, Sam. Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Yeah. It's probably a knockoff of some kind. Yeah, of course it is, right? Right. We budge. Here, let's do it together. You ready? Push! 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 What the hell? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Hmm. Sam, this is real. What is this place? Well, let's go find out. <laughs> huh, this one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. Organ jars. <laughs> cool. Hey, Nathan, check me out. Now, who am I? Huh? Dr. Livingston, come on! <laughs> <laughs> nice. Hey, check it out. <laughs> Hail Caesar! <sighs> it's hot in there. Fertility totems. Aren't you a little young to be looking at that cell? Wow. This table is as big as the ones in the orphanage dining hall. Yeah, that food here was better. <laughs> Wouldn't take much. Damn. They must have thrown some great parties in here. Judging by the artifacts, they certainly had enough money for it. Yeah. Looks like it's been a long time since the last one, though. Maybe don't go waving your flashlight around the windows too much. <laughs> nice. Liven up the place. <laughs> Since when do you like classical music? Excuse me, I am a man of many tastes. Can you imagine being the one to actually uncover these things? <laughs> Must be something, right? Samurai. <laughs> eh? You recognize the crest? Uh, hollyhock leaves are, um, let's see, don't tell me, don't tell me, uh, Tokugawa clan. Yeah, right you are. What? You didn't like that? <laughs> Going it alone. Hey, they've got your favorite book here. Really? Which one? A General History of the Robberies and Murders of the Most Notorious Pirates. Yeah, more like a generally made-up history. Even the author's name is a fake. 
Fake or not, this looks like a first edition. Are you serious? Yeah, this place, man. Wow. Want to take it with you? <laughs> nah. It'll just disintegrate in my backpack. Okay. I don't think Mom's journals are anywhere in here. Let's, uh... Let's check upstairs. <sighs> hmm. It's locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. Hey, the air vent, up there. Oh yeah, that could get us into the room below it. Not us, you. What? I, I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can't handle it. All right, let's see what you got then. Smile, all right? <sighs> Don't lose it. Don't fall. I'll see you on the other side. Okay. It's a good thing I'm not claustrophobic. I'm in. Ah, it's locked from this side, too. And book around. Is there a key nearby? <sighs> Coding. Lots of painkillers.
So? Anything? <sighs> Didn't see any journals. All right, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. Journals galore. Well, let's see what we find. No. Nope. Something. <laughs> this is it. Is a paradise? Whoa, Henry Avery. Guns away heist. Oh, what do you got there? I've never seen this one. Yeah, me either. But that, yeah, no, that's definitely Mom's handwriting. Put up your hands. Slowly. There's no need for that. What is he holding? Hey, hey, you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now, we wait <sighs> for the police. You don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... <laughs> I really don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady. It was no harm, no foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. Hmm. And at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, the, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's voice. Uh. <gasps> hi? My God. <coughs> I could have shot you. Yeah. You're still might, nice, so, uh, do you mind? You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So... Mom was like your translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness and... I'm sorry. Happened a long time ago. 
Of all her discoveries, this would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Harvest Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories? Regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs. Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Learning that old pirate's secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. Here. It is as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Yeah, so, uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out. Hmm? Yeah. Uh, Here. <sighs> Thank you. I'm sorry about the mess. <laughs> Come on, Nathan. Are you okay? Holy shit. Hey. 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 Stan? Sam? Oh, the police. You all right? Wait, we have to do something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. You can't just leave her here. It's nothing we can do for her. We have to run. If the cops find us here, then this... Ma'am? Nathan! We gotta go. Right now. Back from the guys inside. It's a big place. Why don't you take it yeah. Oh. Sam! I got you! Just jump! The chimney. Come on! Come in. Somewhere. They aren't? Don't think so. Let's be careful anyway. The front gate looks clear. Front gate. Got it. Mm. Go slow. Okay. Nathan! Uh. 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 Hey, you alright? You there! Don't move! Run for it! Uh. This way! We can lose him! This is Officer Murphy. We've got two burglary suspects on foot. One adult, one juvenile. Both Freeze, goddammit! Hands Shit. on your head! Stop, goddammit! Heck this way! Go, go, go! There! Uh. Gotcha! Uh. Come on, go! Call for backup! I did already! One more warning! Down on the ground! Hands on your head! Gotcha! Uh. Oh shit! Over here. Damn it. There! By the guest 
south. Run! Oh shit! They're bolting! The dumpster, come on! Okay. I'd say we're clear. But we catch our breath for a second. Some night, huh? Some night. I will wait. Hey. Hey, you listen to me. That wasn't our fault back there. And that lady, she, she was um sick. I mean, it's okay to feel bad. But there was nothing we could do about it. So what are we gonna do now? I can't go back to the orphanage. You can't go back to your job. And we don't. Sure. No, I'm serious. We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Well, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, that's us. What if it wasn't? Nathan, back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Here. I always felt that we were destined for something great. But until tonight... I didn't know what that meant. But this... Mom's unfinished work. This is our chance to restart our lives. With brand new identities. What are you talking about? Well, I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. Now, as for our new name... Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Who's to say he didn't? You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. And I promise, you and me together, we're gonna go far. So what do you say? Nathan Drake? <laughs>